Somebody call a doctor because bad medicine is back. <laughs> That's the answer. This is the Appleton Oak. I'm Mason Quinn. Folks, the time has finally come for us. As you can tell, we're all super excited because we are going to be starting The Boys Season 3. This is Episode 1, and it's a first-time watch, obviously, for all of us. This one's called Payback, and I just cannot imagine where it's going to go from here. Everything has been incredible yep. with this series. I simply can't wait. We had such an amazing ending to Season 2. The big reveal of the senator was the... Uh, not, yeah. uh, what we thought all along, so I'm definitely ready, willing, and able to see what happens this season. Uh, yeah, so uh, I believe it was a congresswoman. Oh, sorry, uh, congresswoman. But, uh, you know, we're... You get your branches of government, government but correct in any regard, here. Season one, season two, wild ending. It seems like uh, Billy and the crew uh, aren't uh, under the radar anymore. Not sure where it's going. Not sure what's happening with the seven. We lost some people. We got some new people on board. I'm pumped. <laughs> Have not been this excited about a season premiere since season two's premiere. So. <laughs> All right, let's go. Whoa, what is going on here? I'm guessing this is one of their movies. The yellow tent. Yeah, the yellow tent. They love doing that in their movies. Mm -hmm. well, yeah, because obviously she is in not that condition. Stormfront. <laughs> I knew you'd be here. Oh, they make her a villain? Oh, yeah. Oh, and it's somebody else. Oh, oh they <laughs> <is there. laughs> and they recast her. <laughs> You'll always be in my heart. <laughs> I can't believe they got Charlie's. And we can reign together for a thousand years. Never. <laughs> Never. Your choice, Liebchen. But not even you could stop me alone. He's not alone. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Au revoir. What? <laughs> we got okay, our guy. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> the classic -train, superhero baby. line for the guy they didn't expect. Yep. Nazi. <laughs> <laughs> Die, winter mensch. Oh. Oh, it's giving me chills. The clap. Oh, oh, the oh, meme. Desert. As a team. The, the, As the, a uh, team. The old private yeah, screening. Here it is. This is meme has been used so much. <laughs> Him just sitting here in the... In the theater. <laughs> oh, yep. Well, looks like everything worked out for Vought. Who's this guy? Oh. <laughs> right, well, after the, you know, Stormfront's a Nazi thing, we had... <laughs> dumping it on Vought Plus. Vought Plus! <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Hey! Oh, <laughs> Huey's gonna be right in front of Homelander. Oh boy, here we go. <laughs> Singles, please. please. Singles, please. Yep. Get out of the shot. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Awkward. Kill me. Only if it's murder, Okay. <laughs> not, not yet. <laughs> Who's um, this guy? Yeah. But it's been over a year and people only questions about the movie. Thank you so much. Okay, um, thank we you. have Black Noir. <laughs> he doesn't speak. You be my man. A big big bro. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you wearing? <laughs> Who'd have thought? Oh god. Oh. Yes. Yeah. Good thought. Oh god, this is super uncomfortable. Mm. Yeah. All along, but storm from. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a look back. It's a crisis. That's why I spent the last year slowing down. In the middle, oh, yeah. that one's been a meme. This one right here. Mr. Campbell. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for coming. <laughs> oh, he just shakes his head right away. Put her in the old vice. <laughs> Keep it together, Huey. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Not quite. Whoa! You look sharp. French blue. That suits you. He's still got his same, same, same thing. Found that little up. We've been on all month. He's having a knees up at penthouse tonight. Okay. 
Who's your source? My source is Nanyo. <laughs> Look, me and the boys, we all set up. We just need you to uh, give us a green light. Okay. Um, I'll talk to Newman. Or you could take your tongue out of her. <laughs> <laughs> and make a decision. Got something you want to say to me? I think I just fucking said it. That's true. No violence or maiming or, 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 or torture or curb stomping or setting anyone on fire. Oh, uh. He's still got the okay, tape yeah, on his jacket. Expense reports. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> expense, report. expense reports. Yeah, because they're, on, they're on, yeah. The, on the books. Yeah. yeah, they're on the books now. Yeah. <laughs> what can I for? Oh, is he yeah, shopping uh, for his son? Yeah. I like Frenchie's jacket. I like that jacket. Give it to her, man. Oh boy, what's going on here? Whoa! I think she's singing. She's singing along yeah, with somebody else. Yeah, lip syncing. Yeah. Yeah. There's no way she's singing. Or is she actually singing? No. Somebody else is. Oh gosh, imagine it. I'm Tyler. Let's get the whole play set back there. Yeah. <laughs> Do a couple of lines, and then it's party time all of a sudden. <laughs> Are you serious? Right. Ready? Ready? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Get to the prostate. Oh my god. Oh, is he gonna Oh no oh, he's gonna sneeze. Oh, oh no. he's gonna no. go big. Oh, oh! Oh, boy. Oh, when he sneezes, he goes back to normal size. Oh, what a mess. Uh. I see nothing. I go. You can't leave. Oh, he doesn't know where he is. <laughs> is he like Ant-Man? Yeah, has a little more like Ant strength. Yeah. No, puto! Get out! Trying to get in my <laughs> 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 Oh, she got him. Uh. Oh! Ah. <laughs> <laughs> what is he gonna do with that? I'm thinking miss a lot, probably. Oh! Oh, oh he's got him with all the party stuff in there. Oh my goodness! Oh, <laughs> butcher shaking him. Go on, son. Never <laughs> oh, yeah, I think he's done. Yeah, oh. he's finished. Oh, he said he won. Full of bureau. Governor's orders. Jimmy Cricket, so oh, deep. Oh. Well, we said they would start hot. And they oh, certainly they did. did. Uh, <laughs> who came up with uh, <laughs> Somebody who watched Ant Man and thought, you know, why doesn't he just do that? <laughs> Yeah, That's what that the is. internet said Ant-Man should have done with Thanos, right? Oh. Yeah, but his the other skin's direction. a little yeah. impenetrable, so it wouldn't have worked. It would just crush Ant-Man. But... Is that what the result was? Yeah, the, the, what it could have happened. Go get the aqua fresh. Okay. <laughs> 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 Billy Joel! <laughs> Again. Uh, I just I think you're playing with fire with the soup. I mean, uh, still not over that uh, that poor guy in group about getting frozen. Well, what's the worst could happen? Oh wait, just what happened five minutes ago? Yeah. Hey, Dad, you gotta move the phone away from your face. Hey, 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 hey. Simon Pegg's back. You know, my dentist, Dr. Horowitz. Mm -hmm. I was getting a crown, and he said he was a huge Starlight fan. Oh, is like, he? Out of the blue, and I'm like, well, you know, she's dating my son. <laughs> <laughs> So, um, I gave him your number. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> why would why would you give him my number, Dad? 
Well, Dad, I just thought. Dad, you gotta move. You, you gotta know, move the phone know. away from your fucking. Phone. <laughs> <laughs> bye bye. I love you. He's sweet. Oh my god. Stay over t again tonight? Don't know, it depends. Um, you gonna bring Aquafresh? I would. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll see you later. Have a good day. <laughs> right back to the <laughs> Joel. playing the Billy Joel. <sighs> if only they knew. Do you think the whole office knows he took out Translucent? I don't know. A soup masturbating outside her window. Oh. Okay, how she knows a soup? Window was on a 737. That'll okay. do it. And he's dating Starlight. Look at him, he's got Where an office that? with a view. You love that bagel so much, you're gonna fake herpes? I could have herpes. You don't think I could have herpes? <laughs> Surveillance go with termite last night. <laughs> you know, I haven't checked in with Butcher yet. Termite. <laughs> no, don't give me that face. I'll bet you a crisp hundred dollar bill, something up. You don't know that. Okay, take the bet. I'm I'm not gonna take the bet, but <laughs> <laughs> look, Butcher's the guy you want in a shooting war. No question. But we're in peacetime. Oh my god. <laughs> so worth the herpes. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Sense a little bit of flirty there, or a little maybe bit, just yeah. maybe just being nice. I've That's never shared my lunch with a coworker before, but Hi. Can I help you? I'm just waiting to see Nadia. Oh, is that the same yeah. guy from the premiere? Yeah, that is. You have the wrong person. We're best friends. I will give her the message. This way, pal. Tony. She'll remember. Uh, oh, you know hey. damn well he's going to put something, piece it together. Nadia, huh? He wants to do some of his own research, and Maybe. the butcher's got a new mission. Mm-hmm. Oh, is this where they're keeping Ryan? Yep. It's got to be. Go ahead. Cheers. Straight ahead. Is that a missile defense system? It's kind of what it looks like. They're taking every precaution just yeah. because of Homelander, and who knows if that's even going to work. <laughs> well, uh. never guess what that is. <laughs> <laughs> you done your own work. I hate math. <laughs> and Grace gets pissed when I'm wrong. <laughs> <laughs> He's changed a bit, huh? Yeah. Safe here with the Colonel. Whoa. Oh, yeah. You cheeky little blighter. <laughs> <laughs> you could stay if you want. Well, that's a generous offer, Grace. I ain't banged the blue ass since I was a lead. <laughs> <laughs> and she had the zinger. I shouldn't get too close to him. I'll just f up. Oh, come on. No drinking? No killing soups? We even follow Hugh Campbell's orders without strangling him. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're not doing all that for yourself. So then who? You know. Rebecca. That alone makes you a better man than your father ever was. Oh, that's Maybe what he's... Maybe that's such an ass. That's, what, that's what he's worried about, is being like his dad. Get a kid of burger now and then, would you? <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, Anthony Starr is just so damn good. There he is! <laughs> hey, it's great. <laughs> Look, it's about how me and my wife Cassandra escaped that hole. <laughs> well, did on me in the New Yorker? You call me the next layer of remedy. <laughs> <laughs> Going clear. How did you get this slot before me? Uh, it was that mistake that talent booker is so fire. I'm asking him. I'm asking you. No. Oh, he can tell if he's lying. Should never go before you, obviously. I'm a nobody compared to you. You want to know a secret? I didn't even write the book. Shia LaBeouf's ghostwriter did. Shia LaBeouf's <laughs> ghostwriter. Oh, he is gonna just lose it. It's very sweet of you to say, dude. Oh, gosh, he can turn it on and turn it off. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? I actually think that went pretty well. 
she doesn't know yet. <laughs> Bulletproof on the outside, but in here, this, it isn't. I'm just as human as all the rest of you. More with Homelander after this. <laughs> oh. His oh my god! He's so, I don't know that I've ever seen a an actor that's more brilliant with their expression. Yeah, yeah. like it's he could literally just tell a story oh, with his face. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, look, look at the background. That. <laughs> that looks great. Birthday photos. Oh, Jackie, can you take this? Thank you. Little starlight outfit. <laughs> you know what? So okay. say, um, happy birthday, Jenny. Oh no, oh. he's not in the picture anymore. MM, what happened? She got with Todd while he was gone. Mm hmm. Well, there's his OCD again. Yeah. How are you going to trade in MM for Todd? I was thinking maybe we could meet over at Cafe Delfini's, have some tilapia, go over some co parenting things. <laughs> Where we had our first date. Whoops. Strictly business. This. Soccer practice, dance recital. You gotta move on, Marvin. Well, you moved on mm. with Todd, or sorry. Yeah, not at the birthday party. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Homelander outfit. It's actually a pretty good costume. Yeah. Uh, I look cannot. at the shoulder pods. They didn't. With the Homelander cake. Oh my God. Just wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, oh, Marvin. That is a kick in the gut. Oh, 24. Huh? Oh, oh that. Marketing is still testing the name. But it's the future, Bob. It's the future. It's the future. Gives a soldier 24 hours of powers, give or take. Uh, it's limited. Uh, how stable is it? Still ironing out the kinks. <laughs> and if it's temporary, that means the DOD has to keep buying doses. Oh, imagine that, huh? How much a hit? Two million. Oh! oh. 60 million per soldier, 600 million per squad. <laughs> People do love a cowboy in the White House. I hear they're even calling you Dakota Bob. <laughs> <laughs> Dakota Bob. What Black Noir did to that hard rock cafe in Lagos should be brought up on war crimes. Uh -oh. oh, now no. it's going to get private. We're going to see him turn. You're right. I'm sorry. You are absolutely right. The point is, you won't have to worry about any of that because your soldiers will only be super temporarily. A lot can happen in 24 hours. Mm -hmm. yep. You used a Nazi to sell it. Compound V is radio active it's not gonna fly in congress i still have a few strings that i can pull in congress oh mm -hmm. what a nice little cut bad news is termites off the table what Vought just closed a big endorsement for him with terminex we've been chasing termite for months i know but after butcher force fed him a metric <laughs> belushi, of <laughs> belushi. <laughs> little coke because he was <laughs> and in return we're getting cold snap stacker and airburst B-lister. <laughs> B-listers. <laughs> you must be Evan. I f***ing love. <laughs> Soup collateral damage is down 60%. Oh, come off it. That's that twat Newman talking. She has... Yeah. Chewy, you're working with Vaughn. I'm... <laughs> <laughs> Just compromise? A little compromise. bit? Compromise. Your whole life's a compromise. Hey, at least I have... Life? Oh. oh, I didn't mean that. <laughs> <laughs> you can stop all this. It's okay to stop, to move on. She would have wanted you to. Oi, Stevie, wonder. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it sounded great. <laughs> <laughs> Just the little stuff they do is so brilliant. Like her looking back, you know? All the details. God, he's just wound tight, isn't he? Mm. Oh, yeah. Only time he seemed calm was when he was with the boy. Oh, and queen maid. God, they're leaving us. No, what? So they could tell the world that we left the rest of them to die? No, you stay back. All of you stay back. Oh, 
Ooh. Ah, he's obsessed. He's got that. I need the room. I got a meeting with Stan. Actually, I invited you both. Have a seat. Great. Oh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. <laughs> he, just, he, he walked fast to get the good spot, the head of the table he wanted. It's all oh. Bright-eyed like Dorothy and Oz in Iowa, and not a farm. Oh well, look how far you've come. <laughs> it's a new bought record. I don't have to tell you that our brand has been a bit tarnished since that nasty business last year. But you. <laughs> <laughs> worthy image to the company when we needed it the most, which is why the board wants to make you co-captain of the seven. Oh, boy. Yeah, but but uh, Homelander is captain. I mean, you're, you're captain. This will be beneficial to you both. Your numbers are down, what, uh, double digits? The public Ooh. still associates you with Stormfront. <laughs> oh, oh, look at that look. Uh, no, I mean, I mean, I'm flattered, thank you, but... No, thank you. If anybody, it should be Maeve. Well, Maeve doesn't have a 96. Nobody does. Except you. <laughs> Look at his oh, hand. Yeah, he's yeah, all twitchy. Twitching. Everybody's been twitchy this episode. <laughs> I'd really like to keep discussing this. Absolutely. <laughs> Set a timer with Samantha. We'll get you one. Oh. The schedule is pretty full. But Try and find you a window. <laughs> oh, oh, cool. oh, There is no way. I mean, you saw it. He He's... can get as pissy as he wants. <laughs> <laughs> you know that he can. He can probably hear you. Good. I hope he does. <laughs> <laughs> it's all pissy. Full authority to fill the team's empty slot. Oh. oh. No. She can make the seven the way she wants it. You should think about it. Go on, take a seat in the oh, big chair. She's gonna. Yeah, I hope she grabs a tall one too, just because it's <laughs> so fire. It's been almost deep. <laughs> Literally thousands of tortured souls who are trapped in that church right now who want to escape just like me and my wife did. It's very brave. <laughs> it's been a game changer. Oh, he he smiles. <laughs> Do you see the cover? The hand the... reaching out. <laughs> it looked like Undertaker reaching out of the grave. Who will join the seven? Will it be Supersonic? There you go. Hmm. As seen as drummer boy. Give <laughs> 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 those arms. <laughs> Everywhere by dating a certain rising star on the Capes for Christ circuit. Oh, oh. what? So the X and then mm. Huey with the Congresswoman. Yep. Live wire. Please hang up your cape and go. Two contestants will win coveted slots in the seven. He's got to put the hey. smile on. That boy band shit is so embarrassing. You know what? I really like Rock My Kiss. Really? I do. Did mm -hmm. you? I, I actually. <laughs> 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 inside joke. Oh, inside joke. And little Orphan Alki <laughs> steps onto the stage and she just pukes in front of a festival crowd. I mean, the tweens, they lost their shit. Humiliating. Wow, that's, I, I had no idea you drank back then. Oh, yeah. Miss Goody Two Shoes, she had a fun side. Big time. Oh. oh. This reminds me of um, Meet the Parents when they oh, first, Owen Wilson. Yeah, yeah, with Owen Wilson. Maverick. <laughs> You've known him your whole life and, you know, took your virginity, so why would I worry? Okay, it was a mutual taking of virginity. Ah, that's right. Yeah, you know, we were really religious and we weren't married, so it felt weird having sex. I mean, sex, sex. We did a ton of butt stuff. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> yeah, never do that again. <laughs> <laughs> never do that again. Co-captain, huh? Wow, that's, uh... Is it crazy? I mean, Vox the worst thing that's ever happened to us, and now you want to be the Ronald McDonald, so yeah, a little crazy. First female co-captain ever. I mean, think about what that would mean to millions of girls. I, I'm sorry, I'm just 
surprise, I guess. I mean, is, is this your mom talking or you? Oh. I've paid a lot, and finally, finally, I could have some real power that I could use, and I could make trouble at Vought do some real good. Or Homelander could murder you. Someone needs to stand up to this guy. And that has to be you. Not just me. I mean, I could bring good people into the Seven who could help me. What, you mean like your boyfriend? Oh. Ooh, Huey. Truth comes out. No one even bats an eye when a man climbs the ladder. Okay, you're right, you're right, you're right. Look, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. So I'll see you later tonight. Well, I don't know about that. Hey. Oh. oh. Let that one slip, didn't you, Huey? <laughs> oh, she looks so terrified. <laughs> Gosh. He does a great job with those fake smiles. Oh, does he ever. I see you got the extra whipped cream in there, huh? Yummers. <laughs> <laughs> Do something wrong? You think I haven't seen you? Shoving back two dozen cupcakes in the break room? You know, I need 30,000 calories a day. Maybe when you actually ran, you did. Oh, oh he's, he's taking it easy. Fastest man alive, what a fucking joke. What did you say? Oh. <laughs> what did you say to me? I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean it. Say it! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wow. Just oh. snapping. Uh, dude's definitely losing it, man. He is not taking all this well. Oh, man. Maeve saw everything. Oh, what? what? Yeah. She did make it. What? Something wrong with my love. Skulking around like a frightened schoolgirl. Today, uh, they starlight co captain. My poor baby. Let me help. Honestly. Oh, come on. They hold that video over my head month after month. They took my son from me. Are we? Come on. Are you seriously? <laughs> oh, jeez. This is Wait. one of the most uncomfortable yeah. things I've ever watched. When you lead an army of Aryan Ubermensch to their victory. What? <laughs> no. <laughs> No, no, no. How many times do I have to tell you we don't need a fucking master race? I'm the master race. That's the point. It took a hundred years, but we finally found you. It's your destiny. Oh, my God, whatever. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Rest. What? No. Please. I don't think he's into her. I think he's just using her for whatever support or whatever yeah. he gets from her, maybe. Yeah, it's recreation. Weird. My lead was good. What happened? Oh, oh that's nice. who she was texting. We gotta talk. I was wondering where he got the video from. Yeah. Soldier Boy. So what? 83, 84, I think, got buried beneath a reactor. And we thought it was bollocks. Hmm. You thought right. What's the PCO read? You believe the rumors, it's the thing that killed Soldier Boy. Some kind of gun or weapon or something. Yeah, it's been a which bone is nearly as strong as a nuclear plant. <gasps> Homelander took Homelander. him out. If we can find this weapon nope. or whatever it is, maybe we can use it to blow Homelander's fucking brains out. Oh, that's the game that's plan. The, yep. Okay. Payback. What a bunch of <laughs> Your mate Noir was in pay, eh? Why don't ask him? Even if that walking tumor could talk, it wouldn't be to me. Here. Whoa! It's 10 feet. One shot makes you a soup for 24 hours. Oh, oh great. So powers maybe, maybe my bollocks swell up like footballs. <laughs> <laughs> maybe a bunch of footballs, but they're strong and they're dangerous. If you're going against them, you're going to need it. <laughs> wow. It's not for research. It's for <laughs> him to take. And what makes you think that me, of all people, would want to turn into one of you? This is our best chance to kill Homelander. Don't up. Laying it down. But we saw at the research facility, they have no idea what happens what, when you take what it. What the reactions what are. What powers you get. Yeah, because Edgar said they're still ironing, ironing it out or whatever. I mean, yeah, you, yeah, well. you don't well, know don't what Don't dump it in a water supply. What are you doing? <laughs> 
A train? Uh, can't so just dump that shit down the drain. Well, I think it would dilute it enough oh, to where you'd think, but yeah, you put that in the water supply, uh, it's gonna uh, dilute it a lot. Let's uh, it quit over here. It's gonna get in the water. <laughs> well, supply. it still could do something. Oh, if one vial was good for twenty four right, hours, all right, all right, all right. right. <laughs> this guy, we appreciate your concern. Well, you want to watch me have a wank? Cost you ten. Where I can live? Where's Ryan? He's at six seventy three. Nosh my bollocks out. <laughs> I don't mean to be rude. Can we just skip to the part where you laser my f***ing brains out? Oh, for Christ's sake. Where's the sport in that? <laughs> <laughs> You're like putting down a wounded dog. Gnawing, <laughs> <laughs> milk shows, and then they go and make Starlight co-captain. <laughs> <laughs> Touche, William. <laughs> These two having like a sit-down meeting is incredible. This is brilliant. God, I wonder how many times they had to shoot this. Like, you gotta be cool off screen. Vault. In the bureau. The wheeling and dealing and, 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 and giving and taking just to keep everything exactly the same. And you and me? Well, they treat us like old playthings and put us up on the shelf. Treat us like we're obsolete. Doesn't that make you angry? See, Billy doesn't think that uh, he doesn't get that Homelander doesn't like Vaught either. Yeah, till now. It does. What if... What if it doesn't have to be that way? What if you and I... Well, what if we share a different <sighs> destiny? Are you kidding me? These two? Scorched earth. Shock and awe. Blood and bone. <sighs> Only one of us left standing. Isn't that what you want? Two fucking <laughs> right. <laughs> I look forward to it. Star. Oh, can't believe Homelander and Butcher were like on the verge of almost making a deal. Dream a little dream. What is he doing now? He's still working. Oh, he's still. Just oh, so he's, oh, he's working for Butcher that. still. Well, or is, is that? Oh, that's the guy from Supernatural. Can be. Haven't seen it. Is he working with Butcher still? Or is he just on his own, chasing on, his own leads? Well, those are the information that he got right. from Maeve. So yeah. he has to be working for Butcher still. Yeah, he must still. be. Nadia. Just real low key. Hey, Nadia! Maven. See you on TV all the time, Nami. I'm not Nadia anymore. We were best friends. That was a long time ago, Tony. You have a platform now. We should tell everyone about Red River. It's not that easy, Tony. I need people to know what happened to me. Yeah. Oh, she's gonna pop she his is. head. She is. She's totally oh, gonna he's, pop his head and you he's gonna see that, it. Now that how he's... His yep. nose is bleeding. bleeding. Oh, he, he's a soup too. Oh, he's going for her eyes. Oh, there oh, goes the got hand. His hand. Got his hand. But it's it's like if she can't see, she yeah. can't do it. Oh, 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 that's nasty. He's still hanging in. Why'd you have to come? Oh! Oh! What? Oh! oh covered in blood and guts. again. Just like they didn't want to be. That's me. I'm in trouble. Fuck. Um, I need a team. East 12th and Broadway. Oh, it's, it's the oh, girl hey, again. there we go. He didn't even want to be covered in blood and guts, and now, no. <sighs> yep, wow. back, oh, covered in the blood and guts. Unbelievable. You know, I oh my had no goodness. idea. I mean, I knew it was going to start hot, right? But they picked up right where they left off with the acting, the tension, the story. Again, we've got multiple storylines going, all of which are incredibly compelling. I mean, even right down to continuing stuff with A-Train and the Deep. Um, you look, gosh, Anthony Starr. I, I don't know about you guys, but I think he's better this season than what he's ever been just in this first episode. Oh, I mean, yeah. the guy is just delivering, and, and that's not to take anything away from you know, anybody else on the cast, but... 
look, I mean, mm. let's call it what it is. This guy can just, he can he's deliver crushing. the goods. I mean, the facial expressions are incredible. How he's playing this role of this guy who's just right on the edge all the time and just has this essentially unlimited power. And the fact that he actually came to Butcher, and to me, he was pitching the idea of, hey, let's, let's you and me the- take down Vought, and then when they're gone, you and I can have it out and see what happens. Mm-hmm. That was, I did not see that coming. Uh, Huey, of course, <laughs> thought he wouldn't be covered in blood and guts oh. anymore, but sure enough, he is. And now he knows that his boss is a soup, has some kind of past. Don't know what Red River is yet, but I'm sure we'll find out. Uh, I've this has just been phenomenal. We see MM is still probably working with Butcher. At least he has all the information. So that right, you got to think he still is. And this has just been something else. I mean, Starlight's old boyfriend. Again, there's, I feel like I could go on and on because there's so many little different storylines going on. But the one thing I did want to touch on, which you all probably know this, but the little details that this show does is just, it's, it just adds to everything they're trying to do, whether they're trying to add humor or tension or just ridiculous violence or mm-hmm. just a crazy over the topness. Huh. I mean, l- let's look at how this episode started, right? <laughs> we had a, an Ant Man guy, Termite, doing his thing. We go from all of that to Huey in an alley seeing his boss completely blowing somebody up. I mean, and all that in the course of in less than an hour. Just incredible. Um, I cannot wait to see where the rest of this season goes. We got, you know, some new characters. Starlight might be involved bringing some new people to the table. She's got her old boyfriend. Wow. Just what a what a way to start a season. Like you said, in the first five minutes, it just mind absolutely blown. I mean, we got to see it's been a year since the, the previous episode, since the previous season. And like you know, my goodness, Home, Homelander's been on a year-long tour of apologizing tour. as they showed the different different boxes of TV stations he was on at the premiere of, you know, the Dawn of the Seven, as he saw that, you know. <laughs> Charlie's Oh, there. my God. They, they could have picked a better actress to be store in front. That was amazing. And then even to how he's going to have to try and take the fact that Starlight's going to be co-captain with him. But yeah, that the meme of him watching, of Homelander Anthony Starr, watching watching the movie where it's going ooh in his ears. I've seen that everything where it's like a sports fan watching their team the thor- like collapsing in the fourth quarter just ooh like that. That's all that stuff. So I cannot believe the lengths this show is going, especially with the the one party scene with Termite. Yeah. Wow. Uh, Amazing. What will they think of next is what I'm trying to think of, but, and how he was going to try and attack Frenchie at the same time. (laughs) Same thing. And again, all that stuff aside, the writing is so The writing has been great. I mean, you got to Ah. see that, that Butcher is starting to have a relationship with the boy, which is amazing to see, because I mean, he obviously could hold a grudge, but they're playing Connect Four. He lost. The kid has a whole different attitude on life. He's swearing. Yeah. You know, oh, I just hate math. Oh, it gets all pissy. You know, it's just it's just so much fun with that. But then how Huey wanted to be straight laced. We show him get jealous. Finally, mm-hmm. like he really wasn't being jealous of Starlight, even though she had all this this whole time. And now he's finally getting jealous because of an old boy band flame of Starlights. Yeah. So just so many directions to go, and then. Eventually, we're going to see that, you know, Huey saw his boss, Victoria, like, uh, do some uh, nasty things. So uh, this has been a Nadia. great start. Great start. Hey, nobody calls her that anymore. That's a different life. But what a great start to the season three. Yeah. I think what I'm most impressed about is I'm just going to continue on um, from season two is the writing. And in particular, the way they're able to take multiple stories Mm -hmm. in one episode look we're dealing with sub one hour episodes Mm -hmm. and they're telling multiple stories you know major things are happening on you know multiple different fronts and they're able to tell the story not have it feel like it's too busy not have it feel like anything was skimmed over and you just get so much out of each episode and it is just the, the writing and we said this in season one i said it at the end of season two and now even the first episode in season three it feels like they picked up where they left off 
And as everybody said in the comments um, in season one and season two, that season three would even be elevated. <laughs> and it, they really, were right. it really feels like it is. Not uh, Look, I think the story so far, I know we're only one episode in, is incredible. I didn't really expect anything less, but let's be honest, there's always pressure. Every new season that comes out, you know, or can they match the first season? Mm -hmm. Can they match the second yep. season? And we've seen other shows where, look, there are 10 seasons, and season one and two were great, and then four was bad, and five and six were good. And you have ups and downs as far as the seasons as a whole. And I, again, I know we're only one episode in, yep. but this feels really great. Um, everybody had said in the comments, wait until Oaksy's uh, episode three. I, look, or season three. Or right? excuse me, yeah. season three. Look, the level of creativity, we know it's graphic, we know it's incredibly yeah. violent, but the level of creativity to which they used to, or which they used to deliver the, the graphic violence, <laughs> I never in a million years thought I would have seen somebody crawl up and sneeze. Oh. Of course, anybody who is a fan of Marvel has seen Why Didn't Ant-Man just go up yep. Thanos' backside and <laughs> explode. Answer, I'd never actually heard the Thanos' uh, and, and that Ant-Man would have imploded. So um, since he's a human, he his, doesn't have his that. Origins would have had to be the same and everything, but um, there's your answer. What a what a wild way to go. I mean, of course, shock value, the giant close-up <laughs> of, oh, God. of where he was headed, and then, of course, the interior. I mean, wh whoever I thought the that, whale thing was whoever, weird. Yeah, you know, off the, I, like, off the wall and then saw that. Um, of course, then we go into the twist with, um, you know, Butcher now having kind of Huey overseeing what he's doing. Mm -hmm. um, we have Butcher interacting with Ryan in a fatherly way. Of course, the big line that I thought was interesting is that you know the commander told him he's already a better father than his dad was, than he yeah, was, which I think was impactful. Um, and I think Butcher's really struggling, you know, with with trying to you know maintain some sort of role where he has rules because in the past two seasons it was you know whatever he felt like doing he yep. did, um, but you know it's the, the the writing's so good that scene with Homelander and Billy I mean talk about incredible acting look and we've and we wanted we to we, see we it too so movie, bad we watch so movies bad. and we watch TV shows and of course yep. before the channel. You know, it, it's no secret that, you know, we were all very much into movies. In fact, when we had a multi-topic podcast before we started doing reactions, that was one of our, our yeah. focal points was was what popular movies were and whether TV shows, whether we liked them. And I'm struggling to, to remember a scene, you know, where you had, you know, better, like, look, there's plenty of, I'm, don't, don't come at me. Oh, there's plenty. Look, there's plenty of on-screen chemistry that has been great, but I'm just saying, between Anthony Starr or in Butcher, um, Carl Urban, the, the that interaction, mm -hmm. the way they use their facial expressions to convey their you know internal emotions and everything, it was just incredible. And I look, I I haven't I don't recall seeing Anthony Starr in anything before we started watching yeah, the Voice. Some folks had recommendations. I don't know yeah. where this guy came from, and it's like okay, it's an Amazon you know kind of gory superhero show, and his acting. Oh, it's, it's just been a really top notch. Yeah. It's really and, next and, level. And, and I don't want to Carl Urban are both from New Zealand. I think is what somebody said. And I and oh, definitely don't want to take really anything from New Zealand. Yeah. Oh, I gotta. I you Some know I've stayed that. away from everything, YouTube everything mm -hmm. with the boys. So I've I have yet to see an actual interview with Anthony Starr, hearing him with an accent. That'd be, so that'd be funny, I'll have to. Yeah. I'll well, have to watch just just as good as how how amazing Carl Urban has been in this role as you know. But I gotta say, Huey, ah, I don't like that clean shaved look. I don't like Huey that clean shaved. Work for me, brother. I like his, I liked his grizzled his grizzled look. You know, you know? speaking of Huey, you know, we he obviously finds out that his boss is a soup. He finds out that she has a past life. He calls a team for a cleanup. Well, who's what team? Yeah, his boss is one when she was not yeah. she calling. But I think the bigger cleanup crew. The bigger thing is that they were watching as the heads were exploding in the last season. Now, now they know. Huey watched. Huey watched the hand explode, that explode, and explode. So not only does he know he's a soup, but he is going to be able to connect the dots oh, that yeah. she was and the one doing that because he knows that she was in the room when game. it happened. So now he's got this all figured out. So now what does he do? Does he stay in his position and try to use that as leverage to you know, go forward? Oh. Or does he bail 
and get back with Butcher, and our team gets back together and kind of. I think he's going I think he's, he should be playing both yeah, sides. He's going to be going to tell agent. Butcher, but yeah, he's going to have mean, to. But keep he's working he's so terrible at lying. Yeah, he's terrible at lying. Of, yeah, <laughs> at lying. of course, and they <laughs> did the they did the the thing yeah. with him and, and yeah. Starlight and the ex boyfriend. Which look, anybody who's been in that situation, it's always uncomfortable. Um, it's interesting. The, the Starlight and, and, the, and, and Homelander co-captain. <laughs> I love and it. Now, yeah. and now I love it. And, and in the V24, temporary superheroes. Yeah, 24 and, and hours. That, and that yeah. makes it so... The, it, I'm just wondering, like... Uh, again, at the lab, we saw, you know, all sorts of oh, stuff. Crazy. You know, we saw you know, one guy had a... You know, we don't need to get into it. <laughs> but um, there's sorts of, all sorts yeah. of craziness. So in giving it to soldiers... How do you, you you don't know what their superpower is going to be, and how would they even get control over it in 24 hours? We saw Ryan obviously mm. had to like learn his powers and right. stuff, so I, I think that's questionable. Maybe they'll explain that a little bit more. If I have like a hey, wait a minute, they didn't really explain yeah, that. Edgar that well. said it wasn't perfect, yeah, no. right, but it's also only for 24 hours. How do you learn it? And you know, what what if somebody's powers it just do, gives like, you a, something uh, different each you know, time, some explosion like the old superhero we saw, right, um, mm. overseas, yep. and he hurts everybody around. Him. I have so many questions, and again, my uh, vast, you know, kind of, you know, list of questions that I have, again, just speaks to how good this writing is. I am so excited that um, episode one started off as good as it did. Yep. Look, I had high expectations. Everybody in the comments said, look, it stays great. It gets even more shocking. I wasn't sure how they were going to happen or how they were going to accomplish that. But as everybody said, they did. So as far as uh, kickoff to season just, three, just absolutely incredible. Reeled us right back in. Incredible. Yeah, just two things real quick. Uh, the thing about the boys that I really like is so many times when you're watching a show, or if you're going to watch a show or if it's recommended to you, some people say, well, hey, you just got to get through the first couple episodes and oh, then it gets yeah. good. Nope, just get through the first here. season and then it's good. That's not the case with this. And then you ask for a more uh, or an impactful scene with two actors like that. To me, I always go back to Heat with Al Pacino and Robert De Niro where they're having to sit down in the diner. Uh, if anybody hasn't seen it, I either say just go see the movie or check out that scene. I've never seen it. Okay, you guys so, never spoiler. seen Heat? Oh. <laughs> I've never seen well, Heat. Well, it, it doesn't matter. That's <laughs> That's, that's not a I'll real think, spoiler. Yeah. Well, that's Two no, actors that's, working together, but let them know, folks. Tell them you want to see that's it. That's neither here nor there. There we neither go. Here nor there. But you wanted two good actors but yeah, in right. that setting. There's, there's so, a lot yeah. of examples it, of on street. There is, but yeah. because with this, is they're both their characters so well. Exactly. I mean, yep. you say De Niro and Pacino, of course they're going to play their characters. Yeah, that's what they do. Yeah. So there we go. Yeah, we're, we're on so the right. road to get through the last episodes before season four drops so for appleton oak that's mason quinn i'm of course the answer we'll catch you on the next one pals